opportunity to welcome all of you to Cyberdyne Systems. My name is Kimberly Duncan. Super! I am Cyberdyne's Director of Community Relations and Media Control. And today, you are all going to see a classified presentation of our latest and most exciting technology. Won't that just be super? Super! You'll need those when we go into the main auditorium. But first, we're going to take a quick look at this lovely video presentation, which I personally supervised. It's going to let all of you get to know us here at Cyberdyne just a little bit better. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is Cyberdyne. run on batteries. Imagine a school system where children in Chicago, Detroit, Los Angeles, and Seattle all learn exactly the same lesson from exactly the same teacher at exactly the same time every day. Where a grandmother can choose from 5,000 television channels and if she can't make up her mind, chooses for her. Imagine the exciting development of a world where a neurosurgeon can remove a brain tumor with technological precision without missing the sunset. Where a mother can tuck her baby in a night Steroids. Where contact lens neural vision enhancers make human error. A thing of the past. It's happening. Today. At Cyberdyne Systems. That's right, Cyberdyne. We're back, bigger and better than ever, and we're ready to lead the world down the information superhighway. Our goal, complete domination of global communications. Cyberdyne Systems has always been a pioneer in advanced robotic systems for medicine, industry, and consumer products, making your life happier, healthier, and richer. Cyberdyne Systems is also the leader in defense technology. By the end of the decade, Cyberdyne Systems will unveil the most powerful thinking machine ever imagined, Skynet. When the Skynet system comes online, this nation and its allies will be protected by the ultimate guardian, the first fully computer-controlled defense system. Skynet satellites in orbit high above the Earth can read the license plate of any car in any city or anywhere in the world. Commanding all our weapon systems in one coordinated force, Skynet can react instantly with anything from a surgical airstrike using a single smart bomb to the deployment of 10 armored divisions or the 6th fleet. Skynet also commands the nation's nuclear arsenal, taking it out of human hands and thus reducing the possibility of error to absolute zero. Soon, we can all sleep soundly, knowing that Skynet is running the show. Thanks to Cyberdyne Systems and Skynet, our children will grow up in a world free of fear. Cyberdyne Systems, the future of information systems and robotics, the future of national governance. Cyberdyne Systems, we are the future. Are we in? Easy money. Okay, listen to me everybody, we don't have much time. Skynet is your enemy. It must be destroyed before it destroys us. Don't believe this cutesy pie video and their slick marketing. These corporate pigs aren't selling safety, they're selling death. They should all be taken out and barbecued. Mom, Mom. the mission, remember? She's a little tense. Okay, um, attention everyone in this building. 
This is a warning from the human resistance. Cybernet is a menace. Skynet threatens the future of the human race. We're going to stop it. You have five minutes to get out. Repeat, all civilians in this building have five minutes to get out. Roll tape. All right. Rolling. Now listen to me very carefully. Only days after its completion, the Skynet computer will turn against us, launching an all-out war against mankind. The battle will last over 30 years, with the fate of the human race at stake. How do I know this? How do I know what's in the future? Because the future paid me a visit. Come with me if you want to live. Skynet sent killer cyborgs, terminators, back through time to remove those who would oppose it. John and I were at the top of their hit list. But the resistance sent a lone warrior, a protector for John. A terminator programmed to defend human life. Get down. And despite my reservations about this particular model, he defended us to the very end, sacrificed himself to save the future. And then John and I were alone again. I thought we prevented Judgment Day, but it is starting all over. Now I know. Skynet must never be completed. Get out of the building. You have been warned. You have five minutes before we will... Making the future safer and friendlier for everyone. And you'll witness perhaps Cyberdyne's greatest breakthrough. An incredible new technology that will change your world today and tomorrow. All right, idiots. Why don't you make sure I'm not disturbed again? Do you understand me? The future. It's happening today. Cyberdyne Systems. We are the future. <laughs> Wasn't that just super? Well, let me take a moment to apologize to all of you for that silly little interruption. I'm afraid it only takes a couple of sad, really warped individuals to just ruin things for all of us. But you can rest assured, we have heard the last of them. Yeah. <laughs> Super. So who's ready to go to the main auditorium? Yeah. Super. In a moment, the doors underneath me are going to open up toward you. Now that's toward you. If you get too close to them, they'll hit you. I'll see everybody on the inside, and remember, the future is waiting. 